The 5th Annual Eastern National Robot Rodeo and Capabilities Exercise is expected to continue the event's tradition of showcasing some of the world's most specialized explosive ordnance disposal robots and components that are designed to allow the warfighter to work remotely and therefore more safely when diffusing a potential unexploded explosive ordnance. Some of the robots are so precise, it's... Like I can do things with the robot I can do with my hands, so it could definitely keep the warfighter just completely away from the device that we're worried about. It gives the opportunity for industry to test their different products they've manufactured, whether it be a robot itself, whether it be an articulating arm, whether it be cameras. AFIMSC's Air Force Civil Engineer Center is partnering with the Department of Homeland Security, the United Kingdom Defense Science and Technology Laboratory, and the Naval Surface Warfare Center Indian Head to organize, coordinate, and carry out the event. Events like this are extremely important uh, for the UK because it gives us a chance to um, see a wide range of technologies and capabilities in action. During the annual Robot Rodeo, U.S. and international military and civilian EOD teams, as well as public safety bomb squads, all compete against each other using these technologically advanced robotic platforms. As uh, EOD techs or bomb techs, uh, we learn pretty fast, especially with robot platforms. But the week-long event also provides several scenarios in which these teams work together together interoperably so the agencies will be able to function smoothly together in real world crisis situations. We can fight one team one fight and have a resolution that will be successful. It further advances the technology available to our public safety and our explosive ordnance disposal bomb technicians and you know just helps save lives in the long run. For the Air Force Installation and Mission Support Center, I'm Brian Godden.